Police say Lamont Murray shot and killed a man in southwest Memphis this week during an argument. But as we found, Murray was already facing additional murder charges. The question becomes, why was he on the street? You see here police at the scene in August of 2020, where they say he killed two people at a motel. Records show prosecutors dismissed those charges. The investigation that was given to us by the Memphis Police Department was not complete. Shelby County DA Amy Wyrick says they needed more evidence to make a case against Murray, and that process took a while. Murray eventually got charged again in the double murder nine months later. Do you think that nine months of between the initial arrest, the charges getting dropped, and then the indictment is an appropriate amount of time? Well, I think, you know, it's hard to say what's what's appropriate, given I don't know what all was needed. I don't know what efforts law enforcement went through. I don't know if they had issues. She also says the pandemic delayed court proceedings, including indictments like Murray's. Still, once he did get indicted in June, he was never actually arrested. Shelby County Sheriff's officials say they tried to find him but couldn't. Wyrick says they need the community to help when there are known warrants out. It's not easy, particularly if the person doesn't want to be found, and particularly when you've got uh, the, the caseload. This case highlights a bigger problem in Shelby County, the revolving door of crime that's gotten worse during the pandemic. Wyrick says since they started releasing people from custody in March of 2020, 1,000 of those defendants have committed new crimes. She has a lot of answers for this issue involving hiring more officers to serve warrants and asking lawful gun owners to secure them safely. Stacey Jacobson, WREG News Channel 3.